Besties, welcome back to my channel. Today we're gonna be doing a full day of eating. It is a Monday. I got to the grocery store yesterday, so we have a lot of good fresh ingredients and recipe ideas this week. I actually have two different recipes. So I have my lunch recipe and a dinner recipe that you guys have never seen before, so I'm excited to show you. But first, I know you saw me doing my breakfast and my coffee. Anytime me and Taylor are drinking coffee, we're like sitting on the couch kind of having like a business conference and like just, just strategizing for the week with content and the podcast and all of that. I'm about to go to the gym because I actually have a um, lip filler appointment. As you guys may have known, I got my lips dissolved because I wanted to like completely start over and I don't want to go too crazy this time. Like I feel like I didn't go too crazy. I would say I just allowed my new injector to work over my previous injectors like horrible work thinking that like he'd be able to like you know fix it but that wasn't the case so now I'm I want to start over and just like make it look perfect so that's what we'll be doing today and I have to go to the gym because of that a little bit earlier than Taylor 10 30 right now and my appointment's at 1 and it takes about like 25 minutes to get there so I need to leave the house at least by 12 30 so I got two hours to get to the gym, walk on the treadmill, and then come back and make some lunch and take a shower and wash my hair. We're bringing Mac with me. You excited for the gym, man? Yeah, he's excited. Anyways, let's get over to the gym. I'm walking on the treadmill for about 30 minutes, maybe 40, we'll see. Sometimes it depends on like how time passes on that thing, but I still cannot work out. I have my two week follow up on Thursday and I'm hoping they're gonna clear me to do some lower body workouts because I just need to move my body and lift some heavy weights. I am gonna go stir crazy if I don't start like actually working out. I went to the park yesterday and I was a little bit active. We were playing spike ball, volleyball and stuff like that and obviously I was being like cautious of what I could and couldn't do. Like I wasn't, I was using like 50% effort playing spike ball. Um, but it just felt good to get outside and move my body. Anyways, let's get over to the gym. No wasting time. We have two hours to get a lot done. So I'm gonna go walk on the treadmill. All right, I'm back and it's 12 o'clock. So I have literally 45 minutes to do my hair, do my makeup and make food, which for me, I feel like is not a lot of time. So we're gonna make a burrito, but we need to prep everything. So we're gonna cook up the chicken or the chicken, the turkey, the garnet turkey. So let me show you what I'm doing for that. Okay, in a pan with some olive oil, we're gonna put a full can of these green chilies, Trader Joe's, and a bunch of diced up onion. We're gonna let that cook up for a few minutes and then we're gonna add grounded turkey. All right, so it's not fully cooked, but it's gonna continue to cook like the onion. So I'm gonna add the meat, and then we're gonna sprinkle some sea salt, some garlic powder, and last some chili lime seasoning. And we're just gonna break her up. This is gonna cook on a low to medium heat for about 10 minutes. Almost done, but now we're gonna add this enchilada sauce. mix it up I did my hair I did my makeup I'm surprised I was able to do it that quickly honestly we have 10 minutes until we need to leave so let's make this wrap let's eat and let's get out okay some avocado smear that on there some lettuce which that is a lot of lettuce a crap ton of cilantro this is so hard to do some Whoopsie. Extra hot salsa. And lastly, some mozzarella or Mexican cheese. Now we need to roll her up and put her on the pan so the cheese can melt. Hell yeah, we did it. This is gonna go on the pan. I want another coffee. And you know what, who makes the rules? Me around here. So it's one o'clock, 12.30 actually. I want another coffee. What are you guys gonna do about it? Tell me that I shouldn't? No. So we're gonna do the rest of this vanilla syrup, my shot of espresso. Yum. And some milk. And there you have it, coffee that I'm going to drink on the way 
to my appointment. I, I can't wait any longer. Like, I need to eat. We have to leave here in like five minutes. I'm so stressed out. Are you guys stressed out for me, like watching this? I don't know. Um, but well, let's say bye. Mmm. Mmm. -hmm. This is so good. Oh, mm. All right, I need to eat this. Next time you see me, we'll be in the car. We are cutting it close, you guys. Oh my goodness. Hey guys, I made it. <laughs> so late. All right, guys. I have numbing cream on. Time to get injected, I guess. And I'll update you guys like after what we do. Alrighty, so we're done. I'm really swollen. Her, like a five out of 10. Maybe, maybe even like a four out of 10. I don't really have that many snacks, but I found these in the bottom of my thing. So I'm really hoping they're not stale because I'll be very sad if they are. They're a little stale, but I'm gonna munch on this as a snack. I think you can get these at Whole Foods. All right, it is dinner time. Like I said, I'm making pizzas, but first we need to cook up the sausage. So we're trying out these Trader Joe's sausages, chicken sausages. There's no specific flavor. Oh, wait, it's sweet Italian, Never mind. I'm gonna cook them all up. I'm not having them all, but I do wanna like meal prep it so that way next time I eat it, I can just um, have it ready to go. So I'm gonna eat two of them today. And then it's an odd number. Why do, I don't understand why packaging they do this. Like this should come with six. That would make the most sense, but I'm gonna have two right now, and then I guess next time I eat them, maybe three, I don't know. Great. so for the pizza, we're gonna do these pita breads. We're gonna do two of them, some mozzarella cheese, some marinara sauce, and some basil. And we're just gonna start to assemble everything while the sausages are still cooking. I'm just gonna put it right onto the thing so that way I'm not making a mess. Some cheese. We're gonna put on some red pepper flakes. We like a little bit of spice. Alrighty, and then some basil. Just throw it on there. This is what the sausages are looking like. I forgot to like slice them, so they're like sliced now. Anyways, I'm gonna take two of them and I'm going to cut them up. Just diced it up. We're gonna take some pieces and we're just gonna throw them onto the pizza. I just know that this is gonna be too much sausage, so the leftover sausage that doesn't go on, I'm just gonna eat it. Oh my god, it's so good! I have not had sausage in so long. Oh my goodness, guys, it's amazing. And the macros are so good. I don't know if I shared the macros with you guys, but one sausage link has 17 grams of protein. So I'm having for two sausage links, over 30 grams of protein. And then one of these has six grams of protein and I'm having two of them, so that's 12. And there's cheese on there. So it's around like 50 grams of protein per this meal. That's crazy. Insanity. Cut the other one and then put it into the air fryer and we're gonna eat dinner. Into the air fryer. I have it on, oops, it's not supposed to be on two, it's supposed to be on much higher than that. Temp. We need to put it up to like 400. I wish you guys could smell this. It smells amazing. So I'm gonna now cut them up. I think we have a pizza cutter somewhere. Yeah, here it is. And on the side, I didn't have an Olipop earlier, so I'm gonna do this sparkling apple cider vinegar drink from Trader Joe's. All right. Let's cover her up with some balsamic. What the usual setup looks like when I do like the little stories of me pouring my drink with my dinner out. So I'm gonna do that real quick. This is so good. I used to do pita pizzas like this all the time and I missed doing it. So I'm gonna be probably on a kick with this for a while cause I'm a creature of habit when I am like very obsessed with something, I do it for a while. Next time I might add like some type of vegetable just to get it in there. Maybe like mushrooms or something, but I wasn't thinking. Guys, now I'm gonna have some bone broth. I'm just gonna do half of this, which is about like a full cup. We'll fill one of these up. 
And I'm just gonna put it in the microwave for like a minute. Okay. We're rewatching Cheer because of the TikTok drama. Dallas, Texas, why did I not? I did not know that. Hello. Hello. Making a snack now. I'm doing some. Oh my goodness, it literally almost just overflowed. Anyways, oh, it's so hot. <gasps> We have cream of rice in a bowl, which I need to mix before it gets super clumpy. I'm going to put a cube of this chocolate in there. And I'm going to use that as like my sweetener, so I want it to get melted. And then on top I'm going to do some butter and a little muffin that I just heated up. Whoops. It's like the garden slice muffins, and I'm just going to crumble that up. Okay, here it is. I'm going to eat this, and then I'll catch up with you guys while I'm in the bathroom taking off my makeup and stuff. You guys, my lips are so swollen right now. I'm like terrified of myself. I literally like don't remember my lips being this swollen last time I got lip filler. So I'm like freaking out right now. Like I literally don't remember them ever being this swollen. I really hope I wake up tomorrow and they're not swollen because I have so much work I need to do. And this is like freaking me out. Also, I was curious and wondering like, what is your guys' favorite part of like my YouTube channel? Like, when you watch a YouTube video by me, like, what is your favorite part about it? Of something that, like, I'm already doing. Because for me, personally, like, my favorite part is doing, like, the catch-up parts when I'm in the bathroom, like, talking to you guys. That's my favorite part. But I'm just curious what you guys are going to say. Oh my god, I'm, like, freaking fuck the freak out. Like, why am I so swollen? I'm so nervous. I literally didn't want my lips to be this big. And if they're going to be this big, I'm going to be so sad. I'm going to have to get my lips dissolved again. And to make it worse, like, I have a meeting with a potential new manager on Thursday. Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm traumatized. Anyways, I'm gonna go to bed. I'm, like, really stressed and anxious right now. Um, I'm hoping this goes down. In the comments, let me know what your favorite part of my YouTube channel is because... I wanna know what you guys have said. And... Yeah, that's about it. Nothing really too crazy or interesting is going on in my life right now, other than, obviously, my, mo my new boobies. They look so good right now, but, um, yeah, they look so good. I have my two-week follow-up on Thursday, so hopefully I get cleared to go to the gym because I want to start working out again. Hopefully, like, lower body. I just do, like, an aggressive amount of, like, hip thrusts and an aggressive amount of, like, abductors. Because I just want to start moving my body more. All right, guys, I'm going to finish this up. I love you guys. Make sure to subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you guys in the next video.